Good morning, dogs, and welcome to the Hot Dog News. We got library news from Mrs. Hale, dash row results, and more after the pledge. Please stand. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Dodgeball News today. Taylor Tots won against the Wasp, and Skittle Devourers won against the Way of the Dogs. They will be moving on to the Final Four. Great job, teams. Tomorrow's tournament will be 2-1 to one odds versus the Final Rounds. They will be battling for the Elite Eight, then the Final Four. And remember, if you want to see all the action, it's all live on the Hot Dog Network channel. Also, the library will be closed for the rest of the year starting Monday the 16th. Mrs. Hale also wants us to know that all books are due to be returned this Friday the 13th. If you do not return the books, there will be a late sheet that will be sent out at the beginning of the next week. Remember that Strides for Stacy will be happening this Saturday. You only need to pay $20 to join the run and will include a t-shirt to help for Strides for Stacy. Last year, many joined the run or walk and we are hoping to see a lot more this Saturday starting at 9 a.m. I signed up myself, so I can't wait to see you all out there. Now to sports and weather. Good morning, dogs. Hey. The track team travels to Southmont tomorrow to compete in the Sagamore Conference meet. The meet begins at 5.30. The baseball team is in action tonight here at home facing Weibo for game two. Game starts at 6. Also, the softball team is here in action against Weibo for game two as well. Game starts at 5.30. And the girls tennis team are in action here at home against LCC tonight. Matches start at 5.30. That's all for sports. Now to Eli. Thanks, Nellie Welly with the big belly. Thanks, Cone, for putting that. The weather coming in day was 67 degrees, which was low. It's supposed to be sunny most of the day. It's only supposed to be cloudy for only two hours. Kind of dumb, right? Back to the weather. For the day, Throughout the day, just like yesterday, it's going to get hot with, once again, the high hitting at 85 degrees with, you guessed it, hitting around 4 or 5 this evening. Now, since I forgot to say my weather prediction yesterday, I won't forget it today. Tomorrow is supposed to be sunny all day with the high hitting around mid to high 80s. That's it for weather. Now let's send it to, Pe now let's send it to the guy who quit Walmart, Kyle. Um... Thank you, I guess. CSF Family Night is tonight from 6 to 7. Everyone will get books to take home. Join the For Cookies and Canvas event and you'll be able to leave with your own works of art. And parents, you can go there to see Dr. Lori who will share information on how our brains develop and what you can do to help your child at home. The Hot Dogs t-shirt design contest deadline is coming up. You must submit your design digitally and must have 2022 Frankfurt Hispanic Heritage Festival include on the t-shirt. Deadline is this Friday and the winners will be announced May 24th. If you have any questions, you can look in the chat. Lunch today, lines one, two, and three is chicken bowl and lines four is soup and salad bar. A happy birthday goes out to Bethy Rojas. Congratulations for surviving another year. That is all for announcements, hot dogs. Only one more week till, or one more day till the weekend. <laughs> Make sure to like, share, and subscribe, and hit that bell for more notifications. Stay cool, hot dogs. <laughs>